I've been thinking a lot about food lately, more so than usual, in a more intentional way, I think. For a while, I think it was something that I was just not thinking about at all and would just eat when I really had to and wasn't really enjoying food and wasn't really enjoying cooking. Lately, I feel like my goal has been three squares baby, three square meals a day. I usually am not a breakfast person, but I want to eat breakfast and so I eat breakfast now. It seems like it should be simple, but it's like actually pretty challenging. And I like to cook and I like to cook for people around me. And when no one's around me, I just tend to not cook for myself. And I'm like, why wouldn't I wanna cook for myself in the ways that I like to cook for other people? Am I right? So in being alone, I feel like it's created a gap of being very into cooking. And I just have been wanting to change that and make new recipes and try new things and continue on that path that I was on for so long. And yeah, I guess I wanted to share some of the things I've been making, even if you can't eat them with me, thought I'd share. Okay, welcome back my sweet angels popping in here to say hi I am excited for this video talking a little bit more about cooking and I just love it and I've been trying to be a little bit more intentional about trying new recipes and just trying to enjoy it as much as I can and yeah have just kind of missed cooking lately so been doing a little bit more of that tomorrow I have a friend's giving that I'm gonna go to so I'm gonna make some stuff for that and also for tonight for dinner and like a little lunch. So yeah, just thought I'd share some of the recipes I'm making. Very fun. Also wanted to talk about today's sponsor, which is Seed. The other DS1 Daily Symbiotic. It's a probiotic and a prebiotic. I'll tell you a little bit more, but I think 
probiotics are a very important part of my digestive routine. Yeah, I feel like the more intentional I am about one thing, things I feel like I've been kind of habit stacking this onto my making sure that I'm eating a good breakfast every morning and remembering to take my probiotics and remembering to take anything I need to take in the morning. I just got my refill for the month in of the DSO-1 Daily Symbiotic. It's so easy. They come in these paper packaging. The fake styrofoam that comes with it, in quotation marks, melts away. You just reuse the same jar. Mine is dirty and gross, but I have been using it for months on end. That way you're not shipping glass. It takes a lot less effort um, and is a lot nicer to the earth. A pre and probiotic in seed or a symbiotic is really important because it's making sure to balance out the good and bad bacteria that you have inside of your gut. And all of these things affect your gut health, skin health, heart health, gut immune function, just relates to so many different parts of your body just from what your gut is feeling and they use their Viacap technology, which makes sure that it actually reaches your gut before it releases the good bacteria and you don't lose anything on the way down there. You can get 15% off your first month's supply of Seeds DSO on Daily Symbiotic with my code Jenny, and that'll be linked below in the description. I think it'll be pretty quick, also pretty easy. I'm gonna leave the recipe linked to New York Times. Um, chickpea, turmeric, stew. I'm gonna half the recipe because I'm leaving in two days, so I feel like I wouldn't get through a whole one. Um, it's gonna be super simple. Also, like ingredients I already had on hand, turmeric, ginger, onion, chickpeas, coconut milk, I went and picked up like some heavier like dinosaur kale um, and that's it pretty much. Bro like chicken stock or veggie stock. So simple. I'm going to get a drink with a friend in a bit. It's only like 6 p.m. right now but it feels really late.
have to run to the store because I forgot some stuff. I'm gonna make a cake, which is my favorite cake ever. I don't usually like cake, but I'm bringing a cake to a Friendsgiving. I need to make cranberry sauce. And I'm going over to Scarlett's because we're having the Friendsgiving at hers. I kind of just changed my mind, and I feel like this might be a better like Friendsgiving instead of cake because I feel like normal cake is like maybe not very good after like a big meal. <laughs> leftovers and I haven't eaten enough today to be honest I have kind of been on the go I'm about to go to the airport 
to fly home to Colorado for the week. I hope you all enjoyed this video. It was fun cooking and like making some new stuff. Leave me a comment if you like this format and I will see you all so soon in the next one. Check out Seed if you want to. It'll be linked below and Illy.